This is Twit. Let me tell you the criteria for a to-do list. I want it to be fully cross-platform. So if I'm using a Windows machine, if I'm using a Mac, if I'm using a laptop, if I'm using an iPad, if I'm using my phone, even if I'm using my watch, I want my to-dos to be everywhere, right? Mm -hmm. That's what it's most useful. Right. Uh, I also, and then, uh, see, I'm finicky. I need it to connect up to Google because I keep my to-do list on Google. Now, that helps because that means if you could find an app that logs into your Google account, it'll use the Google Tasks, mm -hmm. and that will be how it propagates. And that's what Wonderlist, or maybe it should be Wunderlist. Wunderlist. It's spelled W-U-N-D-E-R. You know, it's funny. I've known about Wonderlist for a long time. Uh, as a to-do app, mm -hmm. um, but you can show this, by the way. I know there's a phone number in there, but that's just the number of the of the company. I need to call them before we. <laughs> Maybe uh, someone could call them. Would for you Leo? call them and give my pass? <laughs> give them my passport number. Say Leo's changing. So uh, this is a very nice to-do list program. You're seeing the iPad app, and you see it uses it all. It works also, of course, on the iPhone and even on the Apple Watch. And the way I do it is I connect it, of course, up to my Google. So anytime I change. Any of these to dos, in fact, watch. I'll add one. Let's do it. Let's do it on the uh, phone. Well, I'll add a uh, to do on my Wunderlist on my phone. Create a. Uh, oh, this is another thing they do now. By the way, is they have better categorization, even more categorization. So work, house, shopping. Let's see. Let's say I really need to buy shoelaces. So I'm going to add shoelaces to my shopping list. All right, and uh, add that. Uh, you can, of course, do other things. You can have a due date, a reminder. You can add a subtask, which is kind of cool. Mm -hmm. So maybe my subtask should be put holes in shoe for shoelaces, right? Mm. Yeah. So that's, well, you've got to do that before you can buy shoelaces, mm -hmm. right? So there's my shoelaces. I'm done. Uh, you can even add a comment. Uh, now, that's showing up here. Let's see. Does it, did it work? Let's go to shopping. There they are. So that's great, but now here's the, here's where it, where it becomes a trifecta. I also have Wunderlist, Wunderlist install. Actually, you know I'm gonna do it the right way. Everybody says, oh, you should just go. Hey Siri. Hey, hey, open Wunderlist. I'm too impatient. Siri is a bit slow. Yeah, well, oh, and so, I, so, you know, sometimes I over talk Siri. So here comes Wunderlist. And it's nice to have it on your watch, especially a shopping list, mm -hmm. because then as you're going down the aisles, uh, it's wonderful to be able to say, oh, yeah, I have my shopping list on my watch. Mm -hmm. You don't have to pull out your phone or anything. Um, so here's the inbox. Here's by date. Here's favorite. And you see I can favorite something. So if it's a really important to do, and I can even delegate it by sending it to a person. But let's just go looking at my, uh, my inbox here. This is one of the, there's call a Uniworld. There's a cancel your times. I don't have the shopping list there yet. So even though I put it on the phone, it may take some time to propagate uh, over. Uh, let's see. Oh, oh, no, it's there. I have to look in the right folder. Shoelaces. So, and there's even a checkbox. So, you know, in fact, let's say I bought those shoelaces, and now it'll be done on every platform. Look at that. Could it you disappeared just... on my iPad. It's amazing. That is amazing. Could you just, like, tell Siri? Let's see. Add corn to my wonder list. <laughs> I don't know. Add corn to my wonder list. I don't know. That's a good question. Add corn to my wonder list. <laughs> it's just, you've got you. That's a good question. <laughs> it hurt me, but it not you. you. <laughs> Siri, come on. Do you have a weird thing, like Siri doesn't talk to you in the Apple Watch? Which she I doesn't find, talk. She should it's talk. It's like, it feels weird. I'm like, she Siri, did I say, I feel like she's ignoring me There's or something. A, yeah. Oh, look. How do you like that? I'm all done with my shopping. Oh, oh. that is nice. Wonderlist is a really good app. It does it on uh, Android, iOS. It does it on desktop. It mm -hmm. does it on uh, everywhere uh, on Google. In fact, I even have a Chrome extension on my Chrome browser. When I create a new tab, it shows me my to-do list from Wonderlist. So is it, I don't know if it's Wonderlist, Wonderlist, One, Wonderlist, Wonder. Wonder but I, uh, I, like, I like it. But it. now you have a much more fancy to-do list. Well, uh, do you I, use this? I don't. I use Wonderlist. Oh, that's what I use. You're kidding. My Things was the one that was recommended as one of the best um, Apple Watch apps, so I tried it. I haven't. It was actually more expensive. I think Wonderlist is free, and 
Things, things is like, like 30 bucks or something. It's uh, very expensive because you have to buy it. Oh, not for the only desktop, it's You buy it for the desktop, yeah. and then you have to buy you have to buy it for each yeah. platform. Yeah, so I have that one. I just wondered if you used it, but I don't yet. Oh, so I, I just stole yours. Uh, no, no, I haven't. I wasn't going to suggest we it We both like today. one. What's but funny it, about Wonderlist is I did not use it for a long time. For a long time, I used AnyDo and recommended it. Mm -hmm. um, I really do like AnyDo. It's Any.Do. I've used Gina Trapani's to-do text. I've used a lot of different to-do lists. I, for a long time, I used Remember the Milk. Remember yeah, that? Yes, I but, do. But um, Wonderlist, which has been around it just about that long, because it's a trifecta, yeah. and not just a trifecta, it works everywhere, it's the one I settled on, and it's great. Yeah, Love I really it. like it, too.